Hi everybody, welcome to Mike's Garage. Well, if you watched any of my other videos, you know I have quite a few of the Fisher-Price Hot Wheels. When the grandkids come over, we'd like to get them out and have them ride it. I was having a problem with the batteries going dead. And uh, I switched over from the Fisher-Price batteries over to an F1 battery. This is the small one, it's by Rayovac. Uh, I bought a bunch of these. Uh, they're pretty easy to recharge. They have the F1 connectors. So I did put an adapter in there to uh, use the same plug, but just make an adapter so I could use these batteries. Okay, now what I did is if the battery goes dead, they can use it for about 40 minutes, then the battery starts to get weak. So what I did is at a garage sale, I got two battery backups for a home computer system. So they had 12 volt batteries in them like this with the F1 connectors. And I hung them on the workbench right here and I have them plugged into my bar. So when I come out, I just turn on the bar and it powers them up. Now you hook these up. The nice thing about these charging them, it charges them with a real slow trickle charge. That means they'll last a lot longer. And uh, usually overnight, you can do that. It does not overcharge them. Once it reaches about 13.4 volts, and that's what they should read, a little over 13 volts to be fully charged. If you put your meter across one of these and it reads 12 volts, it's dead, okay? After you charge it, if it still reads 12 volts, it's not holding the charge at all. There's no power there. You're just reading the cell dead. So you should read about 13.4 volts when these are charged. I use two of them at a time in here. I have it color coded red and black. I put F1 connectors on this. I adjusted this too. So I could use the F1 connectors. So you hook the red to the red, black to the black, just like it's on the battery. Let them charge overnight. Switch them out the next day, next morning. Switch them out, put two more on. Cause usually when the kids are here, probably I use six batteries so they could ride them all night long. Okay. It's a lot of fun. It's good for the kids. When the battery starts going dead, they say, hey pop, Battery's uh, pretty weak. Go get another battery, put it on, put them on these. Like I say, it takes about six to eight hours to charge them up on a real slow triple charge. That's what you want and it doesn't overcharge them. So if you could pick up some of these battery backups cheap at a garage sale or somewhere, you could buy them new if you want. But I found that's the best way for me to charge the 12 volt batteries to keep the Fisher Price toys running for the kids. It's a lot of fun. Hope that was a helpful tip. If you got any comments, please give them to me. I'd like to answer your questions. Thanks for watching Mike's Garage. Bye now.